They're wearing armor. Hands up, Ryder. There we go. That's my boy. Thank you. What are these guys? I'm Paran Shai, governor of Arya. We are the Angara. Where did you learn to speak English? Hello. Or at least how do we I'm decode your translations? Yes, you crossed dark space. I've heard of your journey. Joel, I have this in hand. Ephra saw this ship come in and sent me to find out what's going on. He's a human from another galaxy. A pathfinder. <clears throat> Aya is hidden. Protected. What do you want? We didn't know what we'd find here, to be honest. But I'm open to sharing what we know, if you are. Honest. Honesty would be a good start. Kind of cat like. Got the feline eyes. They're. I'll inform Ephra. Hmm. He'll be waiting for you in his office at the Resistance headquarters. Resistance headquarters? I'll there. I will accompany you through our city. Your crew will stay on your ship. Follow me. Hello? Follow closely. Do not try to explore the city or interact with anyone. Ephra's guards will use force if necessary. Understood. Is it okay to ask you questions? I suppose. Jesus Christ, I need to... Oh, I need to... If you're the governor, why do I need to see this Ephra? He's leader of the resistance. Oh. What's that? They're falling right behind me. They fight the cat and protect us. What's happening? We have a visitor. This isn't safe. I detect unusual levels of electrostatic energy in the Angara. Really? This isn't safe. It belongs in a containment cell. The governor shy handle this. You don't know what you're doing. I thought it would be really. Am I that intimidating? You're an outsider who invaded our home. We know nothing about invaded's you. Invaded's a strong word. I'm not here to coming out in plain clothes with no then weapons. Keep moving. How did it find us? He, not it. And stop staring. You know, I'm right here, and apparently I can understand your language now. None of the local flora register in my data files. Fuck. Okay. It's just a scanner. Put it away now. All right. All right. Your city is beautiful. Thank you. You're the first outsider to see it. I'm honored. What happens if Afro doesn't like me? He won't. But you need to earn his trust. He's responsible for everyone's safety. I know what that's like. You're a leader. Kinda. Trying to be. I think I could take it. This is the resistance. Oh, I cut her off. Whoops. They are bullies. But this situation is now your fault. Don't get kicked out, Moran, not because of them. But you're telling me to be weak. No. I am telling you to be strong through your cunning and heart. Okay? Hey. It really is the best one in the resistance. I know. Hello? Our experience with the Ket makes us naturally distrustful of all aliens. Understandable. We've had our own run-ins with the Ket. Then you really do understand. Yeah, 
I killed one of my crewmates, broke the other one's leg. He demolished our sovereign state. Took what he wanted, as if we were nothing. Now, the Ket mercilessly abduct Angara. Often, we never see our people again. Come this way. Ephra is waiting. Oh, these guys sound when like the galactic pricks. You steal your people? And the Resistance fights them every day. With everything we can. Is it attrition? What are they after? You should save your questions for Ephra. They're after Remnant tech. It's pretty obvious at this point. I won't lose Vold. Ephra, this is one of the aliens from the Milky Way. In the Pathfinder. Milky Way. Pathfinder. It's an aggressive move coming to Aya. Sorry, I guess? It wasn't meant that way. I have an arc full of desperate people counting on me to find them a home before they starve. Of course, I feel for you and your people. So, Pathfinder, never mind how you even found us. Why are you here? At coordinates leading here? On a hostile planet we call Eos, I explored an ancient structure, a vault, and brought it back online. It stabilized that planet's environment. Remnant, recent intelligence supports that claim. If I'm right, there's a vault on Aya that's different. I need to look inside. You're right. There's a vault out there, but it was shut years ago and the entrance hidden. Why? We can't help you. The Mushai could. She's our most revered scientist and elder. She knows this vault, but now the Ket have her. And oh, our rescue attempts failed. Never easy, is it? to us. And you. There must be another way. How can I convince you? Can I offer help? Arrogant. I don't know you, let alone trust you. Why would I want your help? Some offering it? Of course. Ephra. I feel... Ephra, what this alien says is extraordinary. The Moshai would want us to be brave and not let this chance pass. Joel, you talk too much. Let me assess this alien. I'll be your eyes. I know you can spare me. Go if you want. But when he tries to kill you, be prepared to strike first. I'm Harsh. Amadarov. I'll be your envoy through Angar and space. Okay. I guess I don't have an option in this one. Thank you for trusting me. I don't. But I can always kill you in your sleep. Comforting. Good to know. Alright, so we need to find that fucking vault now, I suppose. To locked, locked. People to talk to. I've organized my analysis of Aya. Shall I relay it to the Nexus? Definitely. Hey there. Trade? Trade. Trade. Yes. I understand you. Are you asking or telling? I'm wondering. Do you exchange goods and services? How does your economy work? We use credits? We pay for things with a currency called credits. Abstract wealth. The cat offered gifts. Made odd bargains. Never traded. What are your credits worth? What can we do with them? You pay them to us for whatever we're selling. Now we cut open the heart. And what do you offer? Whatever we have. I can set up a meeting to arrange a formal trade agreement. Complicated. Another time. Is there something else I can do for you? Yes. Call me Soka. I run cargo between Aya and other worlds. Good work. Good at it. You're here to help my people. Prove it. I need help. One of my suppliers off-world stopped checking in. Has things I need. There could be trouble. Um, why me? What makes you think I can help? You found Aya, maybe you find my supplier. Can't hurt to ask. Alright. You're one of few people here willing to give me a chance. I'll take it. You have a ship? I have my supplier's nav point. His name is Kelvo. Find him, All right. his supplies. Come back and prove you're helpful. Then maybe we trade. Imagine meeting somebody and explaining currency to them. That actually tickles me a little bit. 
we were like, so we pay through things with, with credits. It's like, well, what do we use credits for? Well, you buy stuff from us with it. So we buy stuff from you and give you the credits, and then you turn around and give us our credits back for our stuff. Man, economy is weird. Stars above. It's you. I was hoping to get a chance to speak with you. You left your home to cross dark space. Is it true you can never go back? Yeah. This is home now. To take such a risk and give up your old life. What the what fuck? Did you do? I just landed on this planet. There are people who hate me and I'm going to flirt with an Angara? I couldn't resist the adventure of a lifetime. I know the feeling. There's a rush in taking a chance and hoping for the best. My turn for a question. Do I get to know your name? Oh, of course. I'm Avela Kajawa. Curator for the Repository of History. Oh, you're a historian. We study relics of our past, try to piece together what we lost in the Scourge. And, the truth is, there was something I wanted to talk to you about. Pathfinder, how much do you know about our history? I know more about the cat than I know about you. The cat hit your people pretty hard, right? They did. But long before that, the Scourge destroyed our technology, first targeting our ships. Many of those ships went down over Havaral. The wilds of that planet are filled with history. A scientist on Havaral just contacted me with a new nav point of an intact crash site. A huge Wait, you're saying the Scourge targeted you? remnant patrolling the area, we can't get close enough. Not like you can. How do you know about me and the remnant? I have friends in the Resistance. They heard your conversation with Ephra. I know it's a lot to ask, but you have a ship and the means to get past the remnant. Without your help, I'm stuck. Does Ephra know? Because I'm trying to I win him over Ephra right now. I don't too happy with this arrangement. Ephra doesn't have to know, and if he finds out, he can direct his anger at me. It takes guts to stand up to him. I'd face worse to get a piece of our history back. All right. I've always wanted to give archaeology a try. Oh, I was hoping you'd say that. If you find anything, I'll be here. Thank you, Pathfinder. These translators must be pretty good to pick up on our mannerisms, too. It's like, some of the shit they're saying is, is pretty human. Rider. Ship's fixed up and ready to fly. All right, let's get across then. Your ship is. <laughs> we have nothing like it. Where do you see the inside? <laughs> <laughs> it gets better. Oh, it's yeah. a damn nice ship. You ready to go? Yeah. It's not the nicest ship I've ever flown on, but it's pretty good. Room. It's hard to compare when your comparison is the Normandy SR1 and SR2. Those ships were. Top of their class in every way. 